Winter can be a lot of fun, but with the cold and flu season, it can also wreak havoc on families. We are here with the experts at Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. Dr. Fogg, what's your best advice to keep our kids healthy? Uh, probably actually keeping your hands as clean as possible. The hands are sort of your portal to viruses and germs getting into your body and then when your hands get soiled with that sometimes you touch your face then your mouth eyes and nose are where the viruses try to get in so um, trying to keep your hands as clean as possible is probably the biggest tip I can give. What about uh, loading up on vitamin C? Um, a lot of people ask me what kind of supplements to bolster your immune system and there's no real um, good scientific evidence saying that one particular uh, supplement is better. Basically a healthy diet um, with a whole variety of different healthy foods is the best thing you can do to keep yourself healthy and also to keep your immune system at its top, top peak level. You know, I know when our kids are getting ready to go outside, we bundle them all up and think if we keep them really warm, we're going to keep them healthy. Well, it's a good idea because it'll keep them comfortable and they can play outside longer, but um, there's no good evidence that actually it makes you um, uh, any healthier to be um, bundled up or anything like that, but it's definitely a good idea. And what about the flu? The flu, um, we're in our second year of the um, pandemic as far as the 2009 um, pandemic flu virus. Uh, the CDC this year is recommending that everyone above the age of six months get the flu vaccine. It's definitely one of the best things you can do to protect yourself um, during this flu season this year. And your best advice to folks, I mean, we fear the cold, we fear the flu, but you say hey, embrace it. Well, um, I'm saying that, you know, it's very inconvenient to get a cold, but people generally get over the cold. And um, if you get a cold, your immune system has seen that virus. And if it comes in contact with another virus that's similar, they'll be able to handle it a little bit, a little bit better. So it's um, not a disaster if your child gets a cold and trying to avoid it is best. But if they do, it just makes your immune system a little bit more smarter. Excellent. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you.